Hello viewers, welcome to today's class. Your teacher is Roger Michira, ready to take you through history and the topic of discussion is functions of parliament today. Remember we have been looking at the, for the, the formation, structure and functions of the government of Kenya. Now we will get to look at functions of parliament. Remember in the previous classes, rather in the previous class, we looked at parliament. We looked at the composition of parliament. Then we realized that parli uh, parliament has got two, two, uh, two, 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 two houses, right? The upper house, which is the Senate, and also the lower house, which is the National Assembly. Then we did look at the composition of um, the, 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 the parliament, right? The composition in the Senate, the composition also in the, the, the National Assembly. Now, today we get to look at the functions of parliament. That is both the, 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 the National Assembly and also the, uh, the, the, the Senate. Now, now, what do we expect by the end of the, the, the lesson class? We do expect that we are able to state the functions of the National Assembly and also state the functions of the Senate. Now, straight to our discussion, the National Assembly, right? And we did say that it comprises of 290 members or elected from each constituency, right? Then we also have 47 women representatives, right? Now, you can see that is now the National Assembly. Good, that's National Assembly. You can see the Speaker's Chamber, right? The Speaker's uh, Chamber. You can get to see the, 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 two, the two sides, right? Those in government and those in opposition. Good. Now, that is the National Assembly. Now, can you get to look at the functions of the National Assembly? And remember, these are people who are elected from the constituency level, right? From each and every constituency. They represent constituents in their constituency levels. Now, what are the functions of the National Assembly? One, they get to represent people of the constituency and special interest groups, right? Talk of uh, this, 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 this member of parliament from uh, Narok, Ole Sankok, right? The one who always wears the, the, the national, the national flag, uh, logo of the, of the national flag, cloth, the attire, right? So he represents the special interest. Talk of uh, constituencies, right? Member of Nini, Nairobi, Nairobi, Nini, South, Mbakasi East. These are constituencies, and also they elaborate on the on and resolve issues of concern to the people, right? What are some of the issues concerning the people? Look at, for example, those those, those um, member of parliament from those members of parliament from Western constituencies, right? They took the issue of Mumias to the National Assembly to be discussed, right? So they debate and solve issues concerning those of the people. They also make and, and amend laws. This is a law-making or organ, right? Law-making arm of the government. So they get to make and amend also laws. It also determines the allocation of national and uh, revenue between the national and county government, right? Remember, they deal, they, they are, they, they deal with the, the issue of budget, right? And in that case, they, 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 they they get to determine the allocation of revenue, national revenue between the, the national and county rev, uh, government. And also, they approve uh, government expenditure, right? How much is the government going to spend this financial, uh, financial year, right? Is the, is, the, is, the, is, the, is the National Assembly that gets to approve government expenditure? That is why you always see cabinet secretary in charge of uh, finance, right? Always, every year. Every year, as the cabinet secretary is reading the budget, he must, or rather, they, they must read the budget from the National Assembly. They, 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 they now, the, the members of parliament get to discuss it, and then also, after discussing, they get to approve the government expenditure. Those who supervise, uh, supervise, uh, supervises national revenue and expenditure. How, how, does, how does the government spend? Then also, they get to review the conduct of the president and other state officers. That's why you see the, 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 the National Assembly can summon a cabinet secretary. The, 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 the National Assembly, right, can summon state of, uh, the state officers, right, so they get to review in conduct, the conduct of the uh, uh, public, uh, public officers. Now also it approves declaration of war and extension of a state of emergency. The president cannot declare a state of emergency without uh, approval by the National Assembly. Good. Now, class, let us go to the Senate, right? And I said Senate has got a few, um, a few people, right? Representatives. It only has got 47 elected members, right? Who are senators from the 47 counties. That's why you see their chamber is a little bit uh, smaller in space. And you can clearly see the, the governor's, the, sorry, the speaker's chamber, 
right? Then you can see the, the those of the, the of the government side and the opposition side. Now that is how small the speaker's chamber is because it comprises of fewer uh, representatives from the counties. Now can you get to look at the the, the, the Senate? But again, one thing you must you, 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 class you must get to to note about is that uh, the Senate represents counties, right? So they get to represent the interests of the county, right? Unlike the National Assembly gets to represent the interests of people from the constituencies. Good. Function of the Senate, one, they participate, they participate in lawmaking function of the parliament by debating and approving bills concerning counties. You see that? It can only uh, participate in making laws that involve the counties. Only that. Good. Determines the location of national revenue among counties. Uh, recently you so, saw, we had a tussle in the, in the Senate. The issue of the, the, the national the, the, the revenue allocation formula, right? How 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 is it? How is it? How is how is the national uh, revenue are allocated? So they had that tussle. They didn't have the formula, exact formula on dividing or on how should they 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 divide? Uh, should, uh, sorry, how should should they divide the national revenue to the counties? Now, class, we have got many other functions there. You can get to see them. For example, overseas expense of national revenue, right, and also participated in considering and determining. Uh, and the solution to remove the uh, president or the deputy president. After the National Assembly has re resolved that it is going to impeach the president or deputy president, it is the Senate that gets now to consider and determine the resolutions. Thank you, class. And for our task, can we get to state the function of the Nas National Assembly and also functions of the Senate? For reference, get to evolving world, history, and government. As always, this is a Lim TV, your favorite learning station where you get to watch and learn. Thank you all.